Tonight, workers told they are off the job. When I got here this morning, everybody was gone. So what's next for thousands of employees who received the notice? Anchor Hawking is halting production because of sluggish sales and a tough economy. Fox 28 reporter Rob Wells is live in Lancaster, where employees are obviously worried about what's next at this Central Ohio institution. Rob. Well, Bob, the Anchor Hawking plant's been in business behind us since 1905. They've been producing glassware products like this for years, and they employ thousands of people here. Most of those employees are off the job tonight, and they're not really sure when they're going to be back. Joe Brown has worked at Anchor Hawking as a maintenance employee for seven years. He usually looks forward to Friday, but not today. When I came into work this morning, and that it looked like ghosts, <laughs> ghosts down in here, and everybody was gone. Brown was one of a few still working in the glassware production plant after Company Brass announced that they would stop operations. Didn't find out until yesterday at five o'clock, and when I got here this morning, everybody was gone. Anchor Hawking says that the company is halting production at all of its North American production facilities because of poor business results over the last several quarters. Officials say that hourly and salary employees have been furloughed to reduce inventory. Some people, some of them are saying four weeks, some of them are saying the whole it's going to be shut down for good. While many are off the job at the main production plant, others have also been sidelined at the company's nearby distribution center. I guess they've had several meetings, but as far as anything else that's been said, they've just kept it quiet. It's those unknowns that have so many worried about what could happen down the road. A fight to get unemployment and face foreclosure. I mean, it, it's a terrible, it's, it's terrible for everybody. And other employees tell us tonight they had a similar layoff here back in January. That one lasted for exactly 30 days. For now, reporting live in a very rainy Lancaster tonight, Rob Wells, Fox 28 News. All right, thank you, Rob.